mastered. I have just made it to the first save station. Now I'm glad to see that there are save stations in this game. I didn't know how saving worked, so those should act as natural stopping points for these videos. But in the last one, we landed on Talon 4 and just started to explore, kind of got the basics of how things work, figure out the visor, um, the normal blaster or beam or whatever it is, the charge beam, rockets, um, the morph ball, and I haven't had a prompt to use the bombs yet, but I've kind of learned how to mess around with the bombs. Let's see what this is. Maybe this will be the first boss battle, but I think this might be a little early for that. Oh, maybe I spoke too soon. Looks like I might be fighting this thing. Well, let's see how this goes. Parasite Queen. Assuming I can't shoot through the blue. Where are its weak points? Okay. Parasitic female genetically enhanced by unknown means. Weak spots has been detected in the car in the creature's mouth. Use auto targeting to acquire this new target. Scans indicate the presence of a potent mutagen origins unknown. The creature exhibits the ability to fire weapon grade blasts of energy from its mouth, a trait not present in the standard parasite genome. It appears the pirates have begun a bioengineering program with considerable results. Wait, are these the like little parasites that have been mutated? Like I just made that connection. Are these the little things? But now they're just like monstrous. There we go. Good thing that's pretty easy to dodge. Well, that wasn't too bad. Was that the end? Is it still alive? Oh, am I just like going out the way I came? shoot him. Nope. Oh, yeah, I haven't even scanned this. The scanning freeze time. 
there's just 10 units of energy. No. Severe internal damage detected. That's what they meant when they said that thing was unstable. Let's morph ball the fuck out of here. circles. Why did the camera just shift like that? Also, I wonder what happens if you fail this, if you just start from the beginning or what. so slow. I might actually need this whole time to get out of here. Oh, is this, is this Ridley from... From Smash Brothers. Oh god, I don't need to fight. yet. Oh, did not nail that. Okay, let's try that again. There we go. Auto turret to save. Why does it say auto chart disabled and then half the time it's not disabled? That's not what you want to hear when you're trying to escape. Okay, don't stand in fire. Oh, that was good timing. Oh wow, there are a lot of pirates here. Is that thing is it a robot? 
Is it alive? Like, is it organic? Is it both? Well, I don't know why my instinct would be to, like, follow the big scary dragon, the space dragon, but I guess that's what I'm doing. track of it and then I'm just gonna land on a planet and try to find it on the ground like that sounds pretty difficult also I hope my breathing into the mic like that when I exhale out of my nose to laugh or the creaking of my chair I'm sitting in isn't too uh, disrupting I do have the gain on this microphone cranked way up. Talon Overworld. New extras unlocked in the main menu. Oh, we. Oh, we have a save point, but we're only about 11 minutes into this video, so. We will keep going. Oh, is this just like, oh shit. No. Also like how the ship, like looks like me. Well, I guess maybe the people that made the, the armor suit also made the ship, so I guess that makes sense. Don't know if that's true, but Let's see, is there anything for me to scan? I can scan my ship. Underclass gunship registered to Samus Iran. Iran, Iran. Render to your ship to recharge energy, reload weapons, and save progress in the game. What is this? There's a small tunnel burrowed in this wall. Oh. Looks like I am still unable to go into a ball. I kind of think I know what happens in this game, or what happens to get your suit fixed, but I'm not positive. Scan, scan, scan. Beetle burrowing insect with a resilient carp is extremely aggressive. Solid rock at high speeds above ground beetle. They cover short distance rapidly. They attack anything that moves near their lair. Did they burrow or did I kill them? Some mushrooms typically grow in dank, dark regions. What is that thing? Oh, that's a creature. Sap sac chemical reaction within sac produces violent explosion when agitated. Because of its irresistible odor and sweet nectar, the sap sac was nearly eaten out of existence. The evolution of an explosive chemical sac saved it now only brave or ingenious creatures dare to devour it. So what you're saying is I should blow it up. Oh nice, it looks like it provides health. Oh, I should have scanned that before. The zoomer anchors itself into walls and other surfaces avoid contact with the spikes. Zoomer's mandibles detect nutrients, sharp spines protected from casual predators with the lack of a reinforced carpus, carapace. Wow, reading this stuff makes you feel stupid. Any 
makes it super vulnerable to any indirect attacks. I think those are from the original Metroid, like the 2D version. Also, this music is giving me Smash Brothers vibes. Blast caps from all the chemicals within these weeds, toxic fungal caps may explode if agitated. The poisonous flesh of the blast caps helps keep it from being eaten. It also detonates its fungal cap when it senses even slight contact. So everything on this planet apparently explodes, it seems. Crap. Oh, that one didn't seem to explode. Is that a zoomer? It looks different. A gamer wall crawling mollusk with retractable spines. Option of the zoomer family when threatened, it extends its lethal spines and retracts its head deep into its armored carpus. Carapace, God, I need to figure out how to pronounce that so I don't sound like an idiot. How the hell do I kill it? swimming is incorporated in this game at all. Shit, how the fuck do I get out? in this game. Oh. Have I scanned these things yet? Okay. Let's scan. What is this blue goo? The stone surface with lichen grows on appearance. On appears too smooth to be natural. Interesting. The stone 
starts to slick and grows on up here. It's too smooth to be natural, okay? So it's not natural stone. Oh, no shit, there's like patterns all through it. There's nothing to scan for that stuff. The zoomers seem pretty harmless. But I guess I'll brutally murder them anyway. Got a new elevator. Anything else in this room? Shows of ruins west granted. Please step into the hologram. Those are the ones that repair my suit and probably give me another upgrade if I had to guess, but I am just guessing on that and based on, I think I did watch some videos about the Metroid story like a couple of years ago. Seismic disturbance. Huh. Okay. I think when Metroid Dread or whatever that one was came out. Okay, it's the same thing. I think I might have like looked up some of the Metroid lore. But exposures have collapsed from erosion, carbon dating. Cannot be cannot determine the age of the structure. God, I hope that chair isn't too loud. Sorry, this chair's a little bit creaky. Looks like some graffiti, looks like some new glowing type thing. God, they got a beetle problem on this planet for sure. Oh, now where are they gonna pop up? Oh, do they only pop up when I'm on the sand? challenging besides just having like a ton of enemies at once because I feel like the lock on mechanic basically is holding down one button well I guess when there's different weapon types maybe I don't know everyone says this game's a masterpiece so I'm sure the combat gets better somehow but again I've heard it's first and foremost an exploration game sound I make because I kind of just do that out of boredom but I also feel like the could be a trigger for some people I kind of like that sound in ASMR videos what is that a war wasp hive primary war wasp dwelling only vulnerable to heavy weaponry war wasps build their homes over existing crevices using whatever are close at hand. They carry building fragments back to their construction sites with their forelegs and glue them into place with adhesive, adhesive secreted from their abdomens. Okay, so I should probably not fuck with that since I don't have any heavy weaponry available to me right now. Assuming I can grapple that later. Grapple point. Can I shoot these birds? Oh, nice, I can. I can 
supposed to be a psycho and murder helpless birds. Good to know. Okay, what the hell is that? Resets at the top of a very... This object oh, rests at the top of a very smooth inclined slope. Okay, that doesn't tell me anything about the object. There's a sprint in this game. I can't get up there. No. I guess this is where I'm supposed to go. No. Could I have gone up to that one by the, the wasp hive? Or did that help? Oh, I guess I could have gone in that one. Oh, let's go check that one out. How the hell did I get up there? I guess I came around this way. Let's hope that those wasps don't come out of there if I get too close. I have a feeling they might. sacrificing themselves for the safety of their swarm. When a hostile life form is sighted, they block its progress by embedding themselves in floors and walls. Impetive scarabs violently self-destruct when threatened. in this trilogy, I've heard that the second one's even better than the first one, and I've heard the third one's good, but not as good as the other two. What the hell is that thing? Ion, a mobile organisms entirely composed of ocular tissue, capable of launching sustained energy beams and active, the ion is sensitive to light, and will close shut if a bright flash ignites nearby. Concentrations of poison identified in tree leaves. Oh shit. New entry. Chozo script translated. Many long years have passed since the Chozo first took root in this land. The passage of time has always been a source of fascination to us. It is the belief of many Chozo sages that the truths of the universe hide within the tumbling currents of time's flow. Even as we search for answers, there are, however, we find illuminations in other unexpected places. We know not how the ability has come to us, but recently many Jozo have begun to sense things beyond the realms of ordinary perception. Strange sights and inex inexplicable sensations of... Uh, strange sights and inexplicable... Oh my god, I can't talk. Inex inexplicable sensations flood our minds, filling us with visions. We take this growing ability to be a sight of our burgeoning harmonization with the infinite. Perhaps finally the universe's secrets are becoming known to us. How profound.
not very reflective. I can't even see myself in it. Oh, shit. Scan, scan, scan. Airborne insect equipped with a venomous stinger capable of shearing steel. The war wasp rarely strays far from its hive. Unless it's pursuing an imminent and immediate threat, it attacks with no regard for its own survival. Dive bombing its enemies with stinger extended fast working, working toxins from the stingers can incapacitate most small organisms. of the creatures on this planet are pretty suicide oriented do not have much regard for their oh shit I don't think those are war wasps I should have scanned them there we go what is this thing oh that's a plasmite small insect capable of storing and releasing thermal energy plasmites are directed to sources of heat thriving on the energy present there they emit light when hunting Expel small bursts of thermal energy when threatened. Well, oh, they're pretty weak. What is. What's that warning for? Oh, I should have scanned that. What's the difference between the red and the something here. Is it mole? Oh shit, no. Maybe that was the warning. Oh, that did quite a bit of damage. Assuming that's some type of missile thing. realized I have a combat scanner thing up in the top left hand corner. I had not 
noticed that previously. God damn, there's a lot of these things. Well, thank God they have the lock on in this game, or this would be the huge pain in the ass. So what's the difference between energy and health? I don't understand that. What the hell are these? Missile ammunition. Five missile launcher rounds. Okay, this gives me energy. Maybe the red just gives more. doors. Well, that was convenient. Well, I'm almost at 40 minutes, so I'm assuming my ship is probably the nearest save point. So I'll probably save and call it here for this video once I get back. everything on this planet. Oh, now I can blow up the nest with these missiles.
slide room. Oh nice, a safe point. Exactly what I wanted. So yeah, this is a little bit longer video, a little over 40 minutes, but this seems like a good stopping point. Made some progress. Made it down to Talon. And unlocked the missile launcher and I had to beat another type boss, so. was good and we will pick it up here and the next one oh did not mean to do that but yeah hopefully we'll get our suit repaired and uh, we'll continue exploring this area but again appreciate you spending your time with me i hope you enjoyed this video and again if you'd like to uh, i guess if you'd like to support me please like and potentially subscribe if you like the content that i'm putting out and again, always feel free to leave comments so I can improve these videos and better serve you. But I hope you have a nice night, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.